I'm Brian Reese. And I'm Wade Tatangelo. We're going to talk about the top 10 events happening this weekend, starting with number 10, one of your favorite spots. <laughs> the best biker bar. And by biker bar, it's really, you can be a non-biker. I don't, I'm not a biker, and I've had some good times there. Peggy's Corral is celebrating their 18th anniversary. Every Sunday there's a blast. This Sunday will be extra fun. Yep. And make sure there'll be vendors and all kinds of four bands. And you've got to try their $2 Bloody Marys. They're really good. Delicious. Yes. Uh, and, number nine, another a musician coming to town. Yeah, Eric Pasley. Uh, he's going to be at White Buffalo Saloon, Rising Country Star. He's got a great new uh, video out. And uh, get to see him there before uh, he can be playing in amphitheaters uh, anytime soon. Number eight is Why is Easter All for the Kids? It's an adult egg hunt at the Children's Garden. It's a benefit for the Children's Garden. So you can go around, find, hunt for eggs, like drink, beer, bills and, yeah, drink beer and wine. Well, there's gift certificates oh, and cool, prizes cool. and raffles and stuff like that at the Children's Garden. That sounds like a lot of fun. Yep. Sarasota Challenge Dance Sport. Tell yeah, this, dance Brian. sport is so cool. It's like ballroom dance competitions. And there's a huge one every year. It's at the Hyatt. It's going to be beautiful to see the costumes, the dancing. It'll be great. I was surprised that our bluegrass expert, Vicky Dean, didn't jump on this one. Yep. Pat Donahue, he is a great fingerstyle Grammy-winning guitarist. Donahue? Best, Donahue. <laughs> and he's best known. He was on the Prairie Home Companion radio broadcast for 20 years. All wow, that great yeah. news you can hear that was him picking. And you can see him in the Prairie Home Companion movie. It came out one of Robert Altman's, I think, last films. Anyway, he's going to be at Fogertyville uh, uh, on Friday. This weekend, the Sarasota Opera completes, la, 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 la. completes its 28-year Verdi cycle thing this weekend. Whole host of events, sold-out shows, all sorts of stuff. So even if you can't go or can't afford to go or can't get a ticket, listen to some Verdi this weekend. Be part of the, they did part every, of the scene. Every piece. I, mean, I feel crazy. like I've been writing about this for 200 every bit years. Of, every bit of music. Every bit of that he yeah. ever wrote. Yeah. yeah. Even a couple of jingles. Um, number four, Green Thumb. It's this really cool event. There's a new... Uh, Brainton based uh, collective and they put this together. It's a Geraldton community farm. Great place. So, yeah, go there, eat some of Geraldton Farms food and there'll be four bands there, there'll be food trucks and it's uh, BYOB if you're 21 and older. Fantastic. You don't have to BYOB at the Florida Wine Fest and Auction <laughs> events this weekend. Nice transition. Yeah, oh, yeah. We, we made it Woo! up on the fly. Professional. Woo! It's not professional to talk about it, I guess. But in any case, <laughs> Florida Wine Fest and Auction, you start off uh, Thursday night with a bunch of winemaker dinners. But Friday and Saturday and Sunday, all the, all the big events, the biggest one is the uh, Banquet really? on the Block, which is right on Lemon Avenue. They set up oh, okay. a huge table all the way down the middle of the street. A lot of fun. But if you don't want to spend $150, $200 to go to some of these events, on the Sunday, there's the Wine by the Water, 25 bucks, taste a bunch of wines. And number two, uh, I had a great time at this event last year. We got Manti Pride right on the River Wall. That's right. Uh, it's never a bad time on the River Wall, no. but this event's great. You're going to have a bunch of bands uh, show up. It's dog friendly and. Uh, have There'll be food time. and drink, all oh, sorts yeah, of things. Oh, yeah, food vendors, drink vendors, and it uh, should be a great time to be outside. And number one, Brian Reese's favorite annual event, mm. the Sarasota County Fair. What do we have new this year at the Sarasota County Fair, Brian? There's nothing new, but that's okay. <laughs> Because it's the Sarasota, Come on. it's the fair. So you've got, I mean, maybe there's going to be some new food innovations, but like, like a different candy, they're going to different deep fried items. Yeah, like uh -huh. I mean, I can't wait for my deep fried cheesesteak or mm. something like that. But in any case, there's going to be a ton of great food, including all the deep fried stuff, including America stuff. my favorite, the Amish donuts and the Amish. Uh, uh, pretzels, so good. Uh, plus all the rides and the midway yeah. games and all the livestock and the animals you can pet that are in the 4-H yes. tent and shows like seals and racing pigs and that robot that wanders around and talks to people. Oh, yeah. It's going to be a lot of fun and you're going to want to check it out. And, and In all seriousness, it's a great spot. It's yeah. at the Ringling Fairgrounds right behind Robarts. Go have a good time. It's a beautiful day uh, this whole weekend. And check ticketsarasota.com every day. We got a fresh batch of things to do. Yes. And uh, have a great weekend. Have a great weekend, guys.